It was billed as a day to safely dispose of hazardous household wastes in Toronto. But residents of the East Riverdale District used it as a platform to focus attention on hazardous soil in their yards. The story from Stu Patterson. Paint, pesticides, acids, all the things that we shouldn't include in our regular garbage. That's what Toronto residents were encouraged to bring to this special depot. People managed to fill 155 big drums with dangerous waste. Two tractor trailer loads are heading to Sarnia, where the waste will be neutralized and incinerated. At one point, Toronto's first hazardous waste day took an unexpected turn. Demonstrators were seen heading here. They were carrying contaminated soil. Get the lead out! Get the lead out! For years, South Riverdale has been plagued by lead pollution. It's in the soil. Queen's Park and the city plan to remove tons of the soil this summer, but the residents want guarantees all soil containing 500 parts per million of lead is removed. The disposer of this material is not able to handle the loose type of material. We've been told that they cannot accept our lead contaminated soil. Why not? And what is your response? Get the lead out! Get the lead out! But the officials did relent. I think that we brought an awareness that we are concerned and that we're not going to give up. He's at the age now where everything goes into the mouth and I simply can't have him playing in our backyard because the soil does end up in his mouth and I don't want to be worried about those effects. The demonstrators also want their homes thoroughly cleaned after the soil is removed. They say there's no use leaving all kinds of lead contaminated dust particles around. Steve Patterson, CBC News, Toronto.